my Wicom tablet. This is what I use to draw, to do my illustrations and my logos and stuff. Um, I do use the mouse and, uh, you know, as well, but this right here is a lifesaver. What it do, this is Yella Stud. I'm from Austin, Texas, and I'm a graphic designer, and these are 10 things that I cannot live without being an artist. All right, so let's get to it. First off, what is going off right now is my cell phone. Need my cell phone. Um, this is how you get in, uh, in touch with me, period. You know what I'm saying? Um, Calling, social media, that's the next one. Uh, we got your Instagram. We got your Facebook. <laughs> and it's all here on my cell phone. This is how um, I interact with people, how I inter interact with the world, how the world sees my art, how I make my money. Um, so, gotta have social media, gotta have my phone, like, I, I can't live without this. This is definitely part of the, the, the recipe, a little motivation, you know what I'm saying? Don't think I have to really go all into that, but, uh, you know what I'm talking about? <laughs> uh, next, I would say, is definitely um, what I use uh, to create. I use Photoshop, and then I got my Mac Mini. Right here, this is my baby. The Mac Mini is, is portable, it's small, I love it because you can just bring it with you, hook it up to a monitor and you're good to go. You know what I'm saying? So, And then of course, um, Bluetooth, um, mouse. Um, graphic designers, when it comes to a mouse, we, we're clicking away, like, I mean, all day long. You go through mouses quick, you know what I'm saying? Um, but the Bluetooth mouse, I love, you know what I'm saying? It's great, it lasts a long time. Um, you do put batteries in it, but I, I love this thing. It's, it does me right. Then, you gotta have your backup external hard drive. Being a graphic designer, um, we use a lot of memory, a lot of memory. I'm saving files. I save a lot of shit. <laughs> so you gotta have external hard drive, because this computer right here, it's not gonna hold everything. And it's also a good period just to have a backup, you know what I'm saying, just to back up all your work in case some shit goes down. Next, oh, my Wicom tablet. This is what I use to draw, to do my illustrations and my logos and stuff. Um, I do use the mouse and, uh, you know, as well, but this right here is a lifesaver. You can do a lot of shit with this Wicom tablet. This is a, um, Interest Pro Wacom tablet. I love this thing right here. This, this is my shit. All right. So uh, when I do, you know what I'm saying, my graphics and stuff, I definitely have to have motivation to do this. You know what I'm saying? I'm not just doing this shit for fun. Um, so first off, um, project-wise, I got my pups. I got my pups. <laughs> they couldn't be here. I got my wife right here. This is my motivation. Um, literally, they sit in the room with me when I do graphic designs. Anything I've done for anybody, my pups have been right there behind me, watching, seeing what I'm doing. Aquarius in Brooklyn. And then my wife helps me out a lot, man. She, um, she helps me out with ideas when I get stuck, you know what I'm saying? She's just there to kind of clear my mind when I'm, when I'm in a rut, you know what I'm saying? Um, I've actually been teaching her graphic design, uh, you know, different techniques and stuff like that, so she definitely helps me out, but that's my baby. I love her. Seven years right there. It's good to have a good support system as being um, an artist, period, whether you're a designer, music artist, whatever, because um, especially an honest you know, supporter that's going to tell you the real. If your shit looks like shit, if it looks dope, you know what I'm saying? She's honest. She's going to let me know if the shit looks shitty. You know what I'm saying? It might piss me off, but I, you know what I'm saying? Whatever. I'd rather know it's shitty and redo it than just be like, oh, baby, it looks cute. No, bitch, that shit ugly. All right, another motivation is money. And you can pay me like this via Cash App and PayPal. <laughs> there is no reason that you should not be able to pay somebody via one of these, uh, you know what I'm saying, uh, payment systems. I don't understand it, but you're not going to get shit from me until you make that payment. So definitely need Cash App and PayPal. Very, very, very important. So uh, in my office, I, I got a lot, of, a lot of shit. I got a lot of Funkos, collectibles. So I brought some of those here because I got to be in my element, you know what I'm saying, when I'm, in, when I'm designing. 
So I got these all over my room. It's crazy. I got like over 300 Funko Pops. If y'all can't tell, I'm a huge Biggie fan and Tupac fan. But this is special. These are all special. These are actually worth money. Um, I love I love these things. I got my scar face. I got like I said these. This this shit covers my room. <laughs> so definitely motivation. You know what I'm saying? Just piss me in my element. You know what I'm saying? I just love the the artisticness of the characters. You know what I'm saying? It just I don't know. It just they, they make me happy. They make me happy. I got my award. Um, I got six of these right here, Graphic Design of the Year Awards. These are on my mantle um, at home, um, whether on my mantle above my computer. I definitely you know, need these. these is, this is motivation for me to keep striving, to keep pushing, knowing that people really fuck with me and my work. You know what I'm saying? So I got six of these going for my seventh one on January 4th. Got Jesus. Jesus here bobbing. <laughs> can't, do it without the, can't do it without the Lord. But yeah, Jesus for real, God's blessed me and my family with, with so much and just blessed me with a talent that um, I'm super grateful for, you know what I'm saying? That helps feed me you know, my family. Um, it just, you know, helps us survive, you know. I just can't do it without Jesus, so shout out to Jesus. And then um, the last things I would say is my notepad. This is where I write my projects down in. I got to have my notepad. I got so many projects um, that I do that if I don't write them down, I'm not gonna remember deadlines or anything like that. Um, so I gotta have a notepad for sure. Got to have a notepad, I'll forget, I'll forget shit. Last thing is business cards. Everybody and their mama should have a business card. If you run a business, if, if you do anything, if you're a counselor, I mean anything, this right here, you know what I'm saying? This is also one of the first things people see when you meet them. Um, and it's, you know, the first presentation that you give them. Um, but you always got to have your business cards with you. You never know where you're at. I've been so many places, restaurants, you know, uh, bars, new establishments, just places and looking at graphics and, you know, ask them, hey, you knew a graphic designer and they're looking for one and I got my card with me. So you never know who you're going to run into. But um, pretty much that's me. And these are my 10 things that I can't live without as an artist. I'm Yellow Stud. Hit me up if you need graphic design work. Follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook at Yellow Stud or hashtag Yellow Stud Graphics. Just look up Yellow Stud and you're gonna find me for sure.